Hmm. Seems even closer than expected. No. Oh, and there's also the training area. Let's see if you guys have a shield. Uh, chest. That's where I thought it would be. Because you couldn't see the two from there. to offer you my deepest apologies on behalf of the Gerudo for taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom, to serve it faithfully. A welcome appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth, well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. <clears throat> your majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. Hmm. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. <laughs> your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. That man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Just his name, even that, it gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. <sighs> there is nothing to worry about. Okay.
So they are reinforcing the thing that only one is born every 100 years. So where is the one that was supposed to be here now? I don't remember if Ronson said it was one 100 years in the previous game or she just said it was extremely rare. <laughs> okay, don't let me die. Uh, actually, I'm not that far from the other tower, am I? The other one. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm <laughs> I was just coming here thinking I'm close to the next tower. Yeah, not really. Uh, I'm not sure where the other tower is. Yeah. I even knew this would be a chasm. Thanks, guys. That's a bit close. That's a little bit close. Yeah, let's try to get that part of the map. Hey. need to sell those. Uh, north. Okay, I can't see. Ah, there it is. There. Let's just grab that. In the car mines. Just mm, tiny area. Okay, but there should be a construct here. Huh. Another mine. Ah. Can't believe this. What is it? Ah. Look around you. None of this is naturally occurring, right? And do you see that? That's a construct. They are really real. Ah. Which means. This unbanned on mine. I know that doesn't sound exciting, but there are the crown jewels of the depths. Uh, not only are they full of crystallized charges, but if you touch a construct, I hear they'll give you treasure. So, yeah. I obviously can let you take all these riches from me. Can I, Link? I'll have your life. Miner's mask. Mask used for working in darkness. The attached lamps are filled with bioluminescent material to light one's surroundings.
Is that like a paint? That's a weird mask. Authorize and verify. Welcome. This was once this refinery where a great deal of sunlight was processed. Fantastic here to manage designs for mining equipment. Please hold on a moment. I have confirmed there is a scam stone you do not yet have. Allow me to rectify that. Instant scaffold. Also prepare parts required to test the auto build. I hope that the skin stones I have provided is useful to you. All the way up here. Should be like one of the first things I can get with auto build. Good. Constructor says night, night, substance command very fast, check up of this, allow me to show what I can do. Yeah. I guess those are always the same. Right. Okay, let's um let's check back on info where she tell me to go now. Oh, she, she left. I didn't thought she would leave. I thought she stayed everywhere. I'm pretty sure I went back to Goron City and she was still there. And she was talking about the same that she was when I was in Zora. So me. Yeah. Oh, it's you. Huh. I just about had it with Kairos Bornis. Uh, now he's set up a tent to camp out by the gate. By all accounts, the place of limits to males. I doubt they'll decide to bend the rules for us. How you got permission to enter? I can only imagine. <laughs> My friend told me he got into Girl of the Town. He said there were lots of hev heavenly smells, which means they're taste things to eat. <laughs> I've been there, right? You've been there, right? How? W what was your secret? Persistent, right? Right. You didn't give up, so I won't wait her. Oh yeah, there's also the... I guess it's here. Oh no, 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 I didn't know... Uh. Oh uh, no, like how I'm gonna take you to the desert without a saint seal. Yeah, no way. There isn't anything around I can use. Yeah, you're not going there now. Ooh. Oh, I haven't seen one of those yet. Oh no. 
I think I did once in the maze. Treasure Rock Rock. <laughs> These particularly clever monsters bury themselves in deep sand or snow and disguise themselves as treasure chests. Anyone who approaches the chest is attacked. It is said that the treasure chests on their heads are actually parts of the monster bodies. <laughs> Arahatag Shrine Drifting Flame Oh, I thought that was stuck to the ground. Oh, so, so I don't even need that. Kendo. Um. Yeah, I need it one. I wish I could keep those things. Even I should have a kid like that at home. Okay, so this here. In the middle. Go up. Go down. It won't get you all of them. Um. Better be fast. Go up. Uh, there. Oh yeah, let's use the shadow to guide me. Yeah, I think now, now it's too high. It's like halfway behind. They stay lit? I didn't notice they stay lit. I thought I had to light them all up at once. Ah, things easy. I didn't get the ch chest. Just that. So 
motorized training area. Things are looking good. Sabak. Sabak. I remember you. You're the one who fought alongside our soldiers. This is a training area for Guild Warriors. The harsh program here are requires stamina, willpower, and smarts to cross the desert. Oh. Welcome to the starting line for the desert race. I'm here to oversee the desert race and give advice to any challengers. Up to now, only Guild Warriors were allowed to undergo training in this rough. <laughs> but since you've already proven yourself in battle, we'll make an exception for you. We ask 10 rupees per attempt as a training fee. Are you ready to try the desert race? So the Gerudo soldiers have to pay 10 rupees to train for their job. Let's do this. Oh. Very well. From now on, soldier, you are at my mercy. Hope you're ready because I'm going to run you ragged. Oh. But first, some ground rules. The desert race, you must pass through seven arches through around the desert before reaching the goal. The desert is hard on a runner. You shouldn't hesitate to use whatever advantages you can think of. Ooh. However, if stray too far off course or across the finish line without passing through all the arches, you fail. Uh, there is also a time limit of 3 minutes 30. I don't want anyone staying out for too long in the desert conditions. Uh. If you can beat the records, there is some traditional gold cloth. Ah, uh, cloth, not clothing. I thought it would be the desert by set, but it's probably the paraglider cloth in it for you. Wait here while I get the arches arts ready. Uh, it shouldn't be long. Hmm. Should I build my cr Ooh. car before? I think that's start. First arch is one, the one close by. Once you go through that, you have to take the rest of the arches in the deserting order. Oh. Keep in mind that the arch on the rocky hill gets harder to see as you get closer. You can see the finish line from here, but if you follow the arches in order, you come across eventually. Oh. So then, ready to get running. The clock starts once you go through the first arch. Get ready and start at your own leisure. That's the first arch or no? I can just make a plane? And... Alright. Okay, it seems to be too little to take me up. Oh, this seems bad. Yeah, I usually put every uh, fan I find around on the plane. I don't think I ever flew one with only a single fan.
that's not been gold. Yeah, I guess it's gold. Well done, soldier. Wow, that took a while. Come back here. Oh, no, I want to check down there. We can go over the results. That was horrible. Oh. Your attempt was 3-3. Three, three. Ah. Well, not bad. But there's a really struggle between your body limits and the harsh desert environment. Even among us Gerudo soldiers, there aren't many who can finish a race. <laughs> there was a beautiful run. Here, eat this. It should help you off. Oh. I finished the run. You should aim to beat the Gerudo soldier record of 2.30. Like, do a try? Let's try it. Ah. This way. I think I may slide better. No, that seems horrible. That's weird as hell. It turns... No, not good. Not good. Let's restart. Uh, let's just... Yeah. I can't. Come on, just cancel it. I'm clearly far from the road. Oh! Yeah, finally! I'm halfway to Gerudo Town, and of course, you can follow the rules of it out. This training session is over, get back here on the double. Yeah, I want you to get there sooner. Oh. Uh, ah, it doesn't matter. Let's do this. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, the desert's long. This feeling way slower. Well, it's slower than it used to be, not compared to what I was just using. Well, I better use some batteries. Ah, I can't overcharge? No? Ah, oh. uh, I don't know I could overcharge. Oh. Man. This course was made for it. There. Well done, soldier. Come back here so we can go over the results.
Oh. Third time was 127. Oh. 127. I've never seen one do better than Captain Tech, but the chief did speak highly of you. Oh. I promise, I promise. Here's something to mark you getting the fastest time. You're the fabric. The fabric bearing the Agildo design. It looks like it could be used to make paraglider. Oh. As of today, you've graduated from a mere trainee soldier. Come again if you ever want to test your limits. You're welcome to any time. But what's my title now if I'm not a trainee soldier anymore? Uh, okay, for Pura, I want to check on Impa again. I don't know where she vanished from, Gerudo. I don't really remember where Impa was here. She isn't here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was following everything she was saying. And since she, I met her there, she's been telling me about the one. No, she's gone. She was here. And the balloon was here. Is in power around here? Ah, oh, everybody's there. Well, in here the flags are in the order. I got them. I'm not sure it's always the same order. Hmm. I wish I could go. I can see so good. Oh, the shoe in there. As well. <sighs> So you may have a lead as to Princess Zelda's whereabouts. I can assist in any meaningful way. How shameful. My insurance are so weak at this point that I cannot even reach the telescope where Pur is located. Ah. Aww. Hey, it's President Noble's friend. Listen to this. I heard Princess Zelda may be in her castle. No way, seriously. Uh. But it's tough to see from here. Miss Pura is so lucky with a fancy scope of hers. No, that's closer than the other one. What if I go there before talking to Pura? Mm. Our hands are a bit tired with her in a place like, like that. Hmm? Oh. What is it? I'm thinking right now. If one poor she's up above, don't be so hasty to climb after her that you miss the our end, okay? Um, I'll check where the girl is here afterwards. Maybe I'll fly there again. Oh, oh hey Link, have you heard? Apparently Pura spotted a figure within her castle. I flew off as soon as I could to try to see who it might be, but I wasn't able to discern anything, unfortunately. I mean, you could fly closer. Ah. It must have been false alarm. I got so worked up thinking it might be Princess Zelda. Chicken. Alright, so. Oh, I could see. Check it. Look through. Oh, hang on. Maybe, maybe you'd tell me to look through. Yeah. Uh, Linky, I heard what happened. Hmm. The major cold in front. That descended upon the Rito and the marble rock rose the Gorons couldn't get enough of. Then there was a sludge contaminating the Zoro's water, and finally the Gerudo menaced by Kibdus and St. Shroud. Mm -hmm. You faced some serious challenges and you overcame all of them. Well done, Link. So the person resembling Princess Zelda was behind the scenes of all the phenomena, as you discovered. This has to be related to the upheaval somehow. And I have something important to share as well. Mm. I thought it was going to tell me to look there. Ooh, we are looking through a scope. There's a moon, some Majora vibes here.
She looks sad. Your Highness. She usually vanishes in a light. Huh? Linky, did you see that? That was the princess, wasn't it? I was going to share the uh, sort of figure or that look an awful lot like Princess Zelda and her castle. I wasn't sure at first, but now I am. I thought she left the castle entirely, but she was inside. We have to hurry and rescue her. Mm. The soldiers and I can reach Harrow Castle as it is now. You may be the only one who can do it. Uh. Uh, I'm sorry, Link. I know I'm always throwing you into dangerous situations. But you really are the only one up to the task. Please, come back in one piece. That applies to both you and the princess. Got it? Mm. Um... Just hmm. the soldiers and I can make our way over there, no matter how we can slice this. Uh, if you can do this, I'm sure you can come up with something using your abilities. Hmm. If anyone is about all this, why did the princess appear so suddenly? And right now, specifically, if she been in the castle the whole time, then why didn't she come out sooner? I can't make sense of it. Suppose I'll have to wait until I can ask her myself. Ah, you guys still at that? I'd like to see what's your regular dialogue here. Are you using the Skyview Tower thing again? You seem to have some kind of death, <laughs> death wish. Well, death wish or not, uh, don't you go die. The last thing anyone wants is to see Lady Rigio all heartbroken. Well, you guys could fly there. <sighs> if I could, I'd fly you to her castle myself. Like, but we have a responsibility to this place. We have to stay here and protect it. The girls got it covered. Ah. So go on and be the amazing swordsman we all love. Just don't get you carried away, huh? Uh... You're going to the castle? Seems super scary to me. But you were strong enough to help present your noble, so I know you'll be fine. Hmm. There is not much to say right now. Do not concern yourself with things here. Travel safely, return in one piece. Uh, yeah, I'm a bit torn here. Mm -mm. I think I did that in the previous one. To get the incomplete and then the complete ending. 